live here at KPRC2 to a developing story we've been tracking since Sunday. Three children found abandoned with the decomposing body of their brother. In just a matter of hours, their mother's boyfriend is set to face a judge. He is charged with murder, accused of killing the eight-year-old. KPRC2's Brittany Jeffers is live with the preview from the courthouse downtown. Brittany? Yes, Coulter is scheduled to appear before that judge at 9 o'clock this morning. And yesterday we heard from the sheriff. He was saying that this case seemed just too horrific to be real. Yesterday we also heard from relatives of the mother about what they say they did and didn't know. Days after deputies found three children abandoned in an apartment with skeletal remains, several relatives of the children's mother spoke with KPRC2. As far as we knew, she moved out of that apartment complex because the last place we seen was the other apartments that she and the boyfriend were at. Everyone sitting on this couch is related to Gloria Williams, who is now charged with injury to a child and tampering with evidence. Williams' boyfriend, Brian Coulter, is charged with murder for the death of her eight-year-old boy. Yasmin Craig says that she has questions for her cousin. Well, personally, I do want to ask what? why. Why didn't you reach out to us? Yasmin says the little boy was mostly nonverbal. Kendrick is auti was autistic. Um, to my knowledge, when he would come around our family, he would all he did was smile. She says the last time she spoke with Gloria was in June, and family asked about the children. You kept saying, okay, they're good, they in school. Anytime we did go help, where the kids at, how they doing? Oh, they in school. The sheriff says it was the 15-year-old who called 911 on Sunday, alerting authorities that his brother had been dead for a year and his body was in the apartment. The teenager also said that his parents hadn't lived in the apartment for months. The kids deserve justice and they need help. I want to, I, they need the physical and the mental help yes. to get over this trauma and put them back on a right track of life. Now, Williams' bond has been set at $900,000. Uh, meantime, Coulter's has been set at $1 million. Again, he is scheduled to appear before a judge this morning at 9 o'clock. Reporting live in downtown Houston, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News. Brittany, thank you.